hi guys this is Jody cooking welcome back to my channel today I'm gonna make some garlic butter corn yeah a lot of people on my Instagram been asking me for this recipe so I thought I would share it for you guys okay so these are all of my seasoning I've got garlic powder onion powder black pepper Cajun seasoning all-purpose seasoning and parsley and it is one teaspoonful and I also have some butter of course I've got three spoonful of butter and I'm gonna also add some pepper sauce so this is two spoonful of pepper sauce it is totally optional but it's gonna give the corn such a delicious and spicy taste so here I have a pot on the stove guys and to my pot I add at least two cup of warm water and I also add one spoonful of butter and just a teaspoonful of salt. So now I'm just putting my corn in my pot and I'm gonna allow my corns to cook for at least for at least 10 minutes okay and make sure you cover your pot and make sure your stove is also on a low eat okay so see you back so my corn's been boiling for just over 10 minutes and guys they just look so 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 good already I can't wait to dip it into that nice butter garlic sauce so now I'm just removing my corns So now I'm just gonna make my sauce for my corn so guys as you can see I'm just adding my butter to my pot just make sure you wait for your butter to melt okay and make sure your stove is also on a low heat okay so that's my seasoning there and I'm just blending it all together yeah you know I do it So my butter is all melt and guys you can always add some fresh garlic to your butter okay and just leave it to saute for at least three minutes just before you had all your seasoning okay then you just want to stir it all together so everything will all combine together okay So now I'm just gonna add my add pepper sauce. You're just gonna continue to stir, and the sauce smells so amazing already. Mm -mm -mm. So guys, I add at least two spoonful more of butter to my pot, okay? Because I think it needed just a bit more butter, so I just add some more, okay? It is totally optional it's all depend on how much corn you're cooking okay so you're just gonna leave your sauce to just come to a boil for at least three minutes latest so now I'm just adding my corns to my sauce and guys it looks so 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 yummy I cannot wait to dig in So after adding all your corns, you're just going to get a spoon and just pour all that butterly sauce all over on your corn. Mm -mm -mm. Looks so good.
And guys, the reason why I don't add some fresh garlic to my pot is because I already add some garlic powder. But for a more garlicky taste, you can always add some fresh garlic, okay? Just make sure you chop it up in pieces, okay? So you're just gonna allow your corns to soak up in that butter for at least three minutes, okay? So my corns is all finished and that's what it look like. It looks so nice and so juicy and so succulent. I'm just gonna plate it up for you guys and show you guys how it looks on the plate, okay? So now I'm just plating up my corns and guys, make sure you share this video to your families and to your friends and all over on your social media. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And hit that notification button so you can receive more videos from me, okay? I will really appreciate all your love and support and I thank you all so much in advance. Pouring all that butterly sauce all over on my corns. Guys, I thank you all so much for watching this video. Until next time, bye. God bless you all.